every student has a random bingo game that they can play. The next game that I'm going to introduce is a very simple game. It's called Bingo. It's an easy way for students to practice new vocabulary. What you usually do is you've got a list of words and you ask your students to make a grid, a grid of four by four, three by three, five by five, and they write all those vocabulary words in the grid. Then you randomly read the words and the students check them off. If a student has a line up or, di or diagonally or, or uh, sideways, then they win. Sometimes, if it's small, you can tell them they have to have two lines of words. Usually, we ask the students to write it down. Sometimes, they cheat. If they are very low level, it's difficult for them to write it down. So, I found this website that automatically creates a bingo game for you. You can add your own words and you can use it with the students. And you can also check who uh, actually got bingo. So it's, it's a great game to play if you want to use up five minutes in your class. Uh, let me show you this bingo website. How it works is you can just put in your own title, whatever the vocabulary would be. So if you have a topic that you're going to do, like for example, uh, sports, then you put in your own words, uh, um, ball, kick, Break, win, lose. You can make it larger too, maybe uh, five by five, um, nine by nine. Then you can go to the next step and click here on 30 free cards. You've got this link. You copy the link and give it to the, your students. So you can go here to chat and I can send this link to my students. And if you put the link into your browser, every student has a random bingo game that they can play. On chat, I sent you a link. Did you get it? Okay, yeah, yeah. I have, yeah, I have seen that. Okay, so what I'm going to be, I'm going to run the game and every time you hear a word, I want you to click on it. And if you have, if you have one line, you say bingo and you win. I go to call the game and then I say call in sequence and I say start the game. Call one, zoom. If you have zoom, click on zoom. Next, pass, pass. It's also a good listening game for students. Next call, head, win. Ah, <laughs> you must win by now, you're not winning? No, no, no. Me too. I think we need one more. I think next one we're yeah. going to win. Okay, let's yeah. see. Yeah. Kick. Bingo. Ah, oh, bingo. Ah, oh, you beat me. <laughs> View cards. Check for winner. Okay, head, zoom, and pass, right? Yeah. yeah. Con congratulations, you win this game. The great thing about vocabulary is, so you've got these words. I would encourage my students to use it in sentences. For example, if they make a line, so you had pass, head, and zoom, tell them that they have to use all these words in one sentence. That's another way that you can get the students to use this vocabulary in the classroom. Very simple game. Students can practice listening and they can uh, practice reading and using those words.